research fellowships from the Imperial Health Charity and the BRC are absolutely vital. They provide time for a clinician, a healthcare professional outside of medicine, to come out of their clinical practice to prepare for a research fellowship. I have always been interested in research because it gives me the opportunity to explore a lot more things that are quite pertinent to patients. This is relatively unique in the NHS that our charity and BRC will put money aside, particularly for healthcare professionals outside of medicine. Research wasn't really something that I thought about at a junior stage in my career, but as I started to develop my interest in obstetrics and gynaecology and got into the training programme, it was something that I became more and more aware of. The research fellowships are a great opportunity for people who want to get involved in research but haven't had much experience before. I was really keen to find a way of getting into uh, clinical research alongside my, uh, my training in neurology and it can be very difficult to find a, a full PhD fellowship to support a project for three years. I'm collecting clinical images from patients with chronic liver disease and liver cancer and I really wanted to progress my research a bit further and one of my collaborators suggested that I apply for this fellowship really to sort of enable me to continue working on this. So this offers an amazing opportunity for those people who are interested to get uh, into research. There's a pre-doctoral fellowship and there's a post-doctoral fellowship and both are really important. I have absolutely loved research. Um, I really hope that I will continue with academia alongside my clinical career. So I've probably learnt a lot more doing the research trial with my patient than what I may have learnt just seeing them in a clinical consultation. I think that working with patients has been the absolute best part of my research study. And I think many of the, the skills that one learns in the research setting really can, can be sort of applied to, to that, that standard of practice. And I've been very fortunate to work with some really amazing people in the department who've been very supportive. Supervising staff uh, doing their research is a joy. So it's been a fantastic experience and it's something that I would recommend uh, to anybody that's interested in kind of doing clinical research. The advice I'd give to staff uh, applying for the fellowship is just to go for it. Uh, this is an amazing opportunity, it's, it's unique, it's only for trust staff. Whatever you do, apply. Don't be daunted by it, don't be scared. It's always a team game and the best place to find the support within our trust is to go to the clinical academic training office. The work that we're generating as a result of the fellowship is, is really important and, uh, and I think is, you know, it's got a strong potential to kind of change practice and improve patient care.